With such a fast rise to fame, Ziggy would soon learn that the road to success has many bumps. I first knew something was wrong when he started botching auditions. I mean, I've seen it a million times. You know, there were so many movies that he was supposed to star in, and the roles went to someone else. I believe the final straw came when he was turned down by the Muppet Show. He really felt that he belonged there. Of course he wanted it. He's a puppet. Am I the only one here that realizes he's a f***ing puppet? As Ziggy gave in to drugs and alcohol, his life spun more and more out of control. Stop being Corey Hayes. It was hard seeing him do an interview on TV all stoned. He looked rough. I believe it was the drugs and the alcohol. And the nose candy. Prostitutes. The dead prostitutes. Yeah, I remember Ziggy. He was into puppeting. Don't Google it. Well. He went full circle. He ended right back in that alley where I found him, which wouldn't have happened if he had had a PR guy. When we come back, Ziggy had hit rock bottom in a town where comebacks are few and far between. But in his quest for mere survival, Ziggy finds something that may just be his ticket back to the top.